Daniel, welcome to the club. First of all, how's it, how's it feel to be here? I'm um, buzzing, over the moon. I just can't wait to get started, really. It's a place that we've spoken, I've spoken to Brentford for a long time and just happy to get over the line, really. In terms of this club, we've seen a lot of youth players develop here. Is that one of the things that drew you to this place? Yeah, 100%. Um, the players that, that have gone from the B to the first team and, and done well and kicked on and it's, it's just what every young player wants to hear and, and wants to do as well, so yeah. Obviously, primarily you, you are a fullback, but you can play across the back line. What do you think you'll bring to this team? I think driving force, going forwards. I like to carry the ball forwards, help the team going forwards and defensively as well. Quite a tall fullback, so I win my, my jewels in the air and, and I can play a bit with my feet as well. So, yeah, just a bit of everything, just to help the team as much as I can. Your journey through football in London has been an interesting one. You came yeah. from Barnet to Arsenal. What was it like taking that step up? Yeah, no, it was it was very enjoyable at that age as well. I was young and and it was just it was a dream to be fair. And going there and learning what I've learned and progressing how I am as a player now, it's it's, perf it's worked out perfectly for me. And obviously, you weren't always a fullback. Arsenal sat you down and said, "We want you to play here." <laughs> yeah. What was that like going from from forward to defensive? Right? No, at the time, it was gutting. It was gutting to be honest, but it was just one of them things. Family kept me kept me uh, grounded and, and told me that Arsenal know what they're doing and, and it worked out and yeah, glad it did to be fair. And obviously around your Arsenal you had some big coaching role models in terms of uh, Perma, Asaka and, play and people like that, how, how did that affect your development? Yeah, it was fantastic, learning from, from the greats when they played and Per was, was always good to me, he had, we had a really good relationship, he'd always help me if I needed so now it was fantastic and just so soaked up everything I could from them like a sponge to be honest. And last season got a little bit of a taste of first team football as well because you played in the pre-season friendly against MK Dons. What was that like as an experience? Yeah, no, it was it was fantastic. I trained with them a lot that pre-season and, and before that and to get on and and go even to travel with them I was over the moon. I found out all, all on the day, so now I was I was buzzing and, and just happy to be there. A lot of people come here and, and talk about the, the fact that this might be one of the most important stages in a player's development going from, from youth football to first team football. What do you think you can get from, from Brentford as a club? Brentford can just show me real play, show me how to play real football at the end of the day and, and men's football and that's why I'm here and that's, that's what I want to do. So I know that Brentford will were, were show me the ways and of, of how football in the men's game is supposed to be played and help me take my game to that next level as well.